What's up, YouTube? I'm back. This is part two of my Pokemon Sword playthrough. Um, yeah, it was pretty hectic last night. Part one, pretty exciting. Didn't get much sleep, but uh, everything's good now. Oh, there's something I wanted to try out. Let's see. I saw someone do this. Yeah. I didn't know if it was real or not. I can do the Leon pose. Let's try that again. Over here. Okay. Okay. Check it. Check it. Check it. I'm going to do it one more time. Just, just for... Just for the heck of it. My life is complete. My life is complete. Oh, he won't even let me go home or check my backyard. Okay. Okay, so. Uh, last time, we, put, we picked our starter. Um, let's see. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's go into the slumbering wield or whatever it's called. Man, there's so many spoilers on, on YouTube um, thumbnails. Slumbering wield. Wow, this force is beautiful. So we're really here just to save one Wulu. Oh, and it's foggy too. But this music though. That violin just... Oh my goodness, that's... That's divine. I love music. can't even compare it it's it's that's majestic music right there I don't even know what to say about it Ooh, spooky okay so this is the first first actual encounter with um with grass we haven't even been in grass yet and we have a level 7 sobble so um I'm pretty nervous like I'm pretty sure that it's just gonna j jump out like the old games. Well, overworld Pokemon might be saved for later. Yep. It's a new Pokemon I've never seen before! What is that? What is that? It's a Squovit. Squovit. Like Squirrel and Covet. If I'm if I'm not mistaken. Oh, look at his cheeks! Look at his little chibi chipmunk cheeks. I have no idea about what what this thing is. Okay, uh, level two. We don't even know what type it is. I feel like a kid again. I don't know what I'm doing. I can't remember the last time I played a game and I didn't know what I was doing. Whoa. Wait, we don't have any balls. We can't catch it. Aw, that's a shame. We have no choice but to beat it up. Oh well. That wasn't so hard. Uh, it just gives me the chills to see a Pokemon for the first time. And not even in a trailer, but while playing. There's no feeling like it. Okay. Um. Obviously, Mystery Gift is not available at the moment, or else I would be able to get my 12 Quick Balls. So, no Pokeballs at all. Which is a shame. So let's, let's go. Yay, free healing! Spooky.
Another new Pokemon. I'm like, what? Oh, I'm too tired to freak out. Ooh, a nerve. I can't eat berries. Oh. Oh, that's okay. Rookie D. Rookie and Chickadee. I'm good with names. Let's see. Do I like it? I don't know. I wonder if it evolves into Corviknight or something that we've already seen. Probably not. We'll see. Wow. That's not too many experience points, which is nice and slow for us. And this is worth it. Ah, oh, I didn't even hear it. What was that? You heard it sounded like a howling. Anyway, there, there's no better experience than just blind reactions, you know? Because you have... I have no idea what I'm going to find, you know? That squirrel? Never seen it before. That bird? It's another school bit. Okay. Okay. At least we're getting... Oh, and now we can find out what type it is. Normal. Okay, so as whenever it's your first encounter with a Pokemon, you don't know what type it is. This has been the, the thing in previous games. But as soon as you encounter it the second time and so on, it tells you what type it is, even though we don't even have a Pokedex. So yeah, we know it's a normal type. I could have told you that, you know. It's not not, not that surprising. It's so cute! <laughs> I'm getting Unova vibes. I'm getting some d Dragon Spiral Tower feelings from this music. Gorgeous. Okay, let's get this over with. Howling. Yeah, Wulu might be in real trouble. Wait, what if what if this is like the legendary Pokemon and it tries to eat Wulu? That doesn't explain why Wulu was coming here on purpose. I can't see a thing. I'm I'm getting really, really worried here. Like I could walk off a cliff. Okay, you're not you're not making me comfortable, game. I can't see where I'm going. Okay. Something's coming. Something is coming. Oh, it's a doggo. One of his ears is missing, and he has braided hair like some sort of German girl. Big tails. That's cute. What? We're battling it? We don't know its name, we don't know its type, we don't even know its level. I'm gonna have a panic attack if, if this is 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 gonna like body us. Okay. What type is it? The move just disappeared. It's a ghost, but not a ghost type. I'm getting really freaked out here. 
This thing can summon fog. And we're in its territory. Okay, this is getting really, really creepy. And obviously it doesn't even have its sword. That was unbelievably creepy. I don't like uh, scary stuff. No, that's not for me. But... I thought he was gonna attack us and apparently he did. One of us ends up being possessed by some ghost after this. I'm not going to be happy. Ah, oh, Leon. Ah, oh, that music. Oh, gorgeous. <laughs> Your pants are direct. <laughs> I don't even I've never even heard that phrase, but I know what it means just from the context. You always get lost. They call him Roro Noah Zoro. <laughs> hey, where is Wulu? Ah, meh. Good chat. Your moves pass right through it. Weird illusions, ooh, creepy. Man, encountering a legend at the beginning of your adventure, you don't see that often in a Pokemon game. I mean, sure, in like Diamond, Pearl, and Platinum, I think you heard Mesprit's cry, but you only hear it, you don't see it. This is a unique experience for me. Wedgehurst. Oh, there there's two Badu now. Do you do? Badu? Man, I thought that wolf was going to eat us. Wow, wow. Yay, pocket money. Wow, wow. <laughs> like, you're gonna, like, turn me into a battle tool? <laughs> uh. East or west, home is best. I like that. Okay. Say goodbye to Pikachu doll. Say goodbye to the comfort of our home. We're going camping forever now. What else do we have here? Uh, oh, mystery gift. Okay, so yeah, the mystery gift is um, available. So I'm just going to go plug in my code and grab 12 quick balls. But of course, I'm going to save them for when I actually want a Pokemon. But for everything else, like, I might just use a regular Pokeball since I don't want to waste them. Okay, so, wow, someone gave us five Pokeballs. I guess I wasn't paying attention. Five Pokeballs, 12 Quick Balls, three Potion. That's a good start. That's a decent start. And we have a Fishing Rod. So, yeah. Um, let's get going. Let's see. 
Where are we off to today? The research lab, okay, I thought so. Okay, so obviously we have to go into the tall grass. We might catch a Pokemon right now and then end the episode. I guess this way is blocked. They're sleeping, aww. Okay, rookie D's. One of you is going to be caught by me. Oh, it's another one of those. Squall bit. Hmm. Actually... I'm not gonna catch it. I'm gonna save that for the post game. Filling up my Pokedex. Right now, I'm only catching Pokemon I actually feel I want on my team. We lowered our defense, obviously. Oh, it even tells you what ability you have. But not much about the score of it. Oh, I really want to catch a Pokemon this episode, but I don't think Squabit or Rookie D is doing it for me. Like, ah. Uh. Maybe if I knew their evolutions and, and their typings. And their abilities, you know? Stuff like that. Rookie D? Rookie D. Flying. It's beautiful. Uh, yes! Yes! Ah, oh, ever since they just made bird Pokemon after bird Pokemon. They're always normal flying, normal flying, normal flying. Sometimes they evolve into something else. Every generation. And the only pure flying type that we ever had was a legendary Pokemon, Ternatus. Finally, a flying type that's not normal. I don't know. I mean, I'm not saying that's better or anything. It's just new, you know? Like, change it up a bit, you know? Same old, same old. You know, I really am tempted to catch it. Because my, my habit is to catch everything. I'm like really, really compulsive about catching Pokemon. Like I want to fill up the Pokedex as fast as possible. Oh, but let's let's get like these shots. They're like really nice, like very new. Yeah, I'm not going to catch it now. I'll, sa I'll save it for when like, you know. It might be a higher level in a future route. No point in training it myself when it's going to be just a higher level later on. Why didn't they just use Water Gun again? And I gotta say, I don't hate its design. Both the Squirrel and the Bird, they're both pretty good. get bind. Not my favorite move, but you know, we gotta use our tail somehow. This grass is full of birds. Another scroll of it. Did it always have orange orange freckles and nose or, it, or am I imagining it? I must be imagining it. I thought it changed. I thought it changed its coloring for a second. We'll know if it's shiny when it when it is. But like you know, you know it when you see it. But I've never seen these Pokemon before, so I wouldn't know if it was shiny unless it sparkled. Oh, 
Okay, um, that's enough training for now. This was a nice episode. We nearly got eaten by that legendary wolf, although for some reason it didn't have its sword, so that's obviously going to be um, important to the story. I already have a theory about that. I'm guessing the legendary Pokemon, Sword vs. Shield, are missing their Sword vs. Shield, and you have to find it, sort of like the Sword in the Stone. But I'm just speculating, you know? I'm like, you know, making guesses. So... We'll end this episode here, continue on after this. Um, man, that forest was spooky, just just saying. But the music, oh, I want to go there just for the music. I want to go back, but obviously we can't. Um, again, I really wish I could catch every single Pokemon, but right now I don't have time for that. I have to save my team for my Pokemon that I really want to see, really want to like meet, you know? And I keep seeing thumbnails, spoiling Pokemon, on YouTube, which is a shame because, like, I'm not gonna give up YouTube just because people have played ahead of me by a day. So, yeah. Um, this is... This was a good episode. This was a good episode. Good place to end it here. Thank you guys for watching. Please like and subscribe, share with a friend, and come back for the next episode. And thank you guys again. Uh, I'll see you guys next time.